<laughs> I am not ready for this. I'm really, Scrab. I'm really not ready for this. Scrab. Welcome back to Kirby Superstar. We're the Spiffy Needle Geeks, and now we're about to do the worst mode in Kirby Superstar ever. I, I like the Great Cave Offensive. This, Fuck you. Uh, well, I, well, what's what's wrong with the Great Cave Offensive? Uh, well, we'll we'll get into it as we go along. First story. Bye, Kirby. How the fuck do you miss that? <laughs> Kirby. Well, Kirby is still a baby. I mean, true. Plus, it's not it's not exactly like he died from it or anything. Yeah. Kirby is. <laughs> he just got uh, a little bandage on his head. That's it. Yeah. So we went from a, starting a new game to another new game screen. It's like, how many new game screens are in this one? Like, eight, I believe. Also, Danny's here. If you guys didn't notice. Oh, I'm, sure, I'm pretty sure they noticed. <laughs> anyway. Basic uh, basic objective about the Great Cave Offensive. It's... I, I, a, ma a makeshift Metroid Mania. Yes, if, if you want to call it that. It's not required to get every single treasure in the game. That's just the gimmick that they got going on for here. It's, it's for points. Yeah, it, it's just not the like, points. Like you see in the bottom, like in the bottom left, like you see zero G. That's your gold. You you, you get gold for, depending on the value. Like not like now he's at ten, now he's at ten thousand gold. Yeah, picking up a gold medal. So pretty much the the point is just to sell up your gold. And that, that, that's, that's the equivalent of like a, like, a, like a high school. Mm -hmm. And the objective is to go through, like there's many different areas in the Great Cave Offensive, and you're wanna and you're gonna wanna travel through each area, gathering as many treasures as you can. Russell, you fool! I know. You fool! I know. I s you fell for the most you, you, you fell for the most obvious. What happened? Trap. Well, for, well, regardless, if you if you if you leave a room there's, and go back in, then it's like it never yeah. happened. Still, you scrub. Like there, there's there's a trap that that Sakurai likes to put in a lot of his Kirby games. Well, well not just Sakurai, just in general. If you blow up that bomb in the middle, it would it would create an op it would create a lava path, which would, which would keep you from being able to get to this treasure chest over here. Yeah, but we got it regardless. <laughs> Bless you. Bless you. Sorry. Yeah, it's it's a it's a trap that, that that's put into a lot of Kirby games when it comes to collectibles. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, moving on. Which is Kirby? Kirby just got a got a whip. <laughs> Even though we, we, we won't see Whip Kirby until... Return to Dreamland. Land. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> God again? damn it! <laughs> Kirby makes Danny sneeze. It's these fucking feathers, man. Yeah, I got stuck here for a while. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Russell's trying to do another puzzle that he's failing at. You, like, it, the, if you, you press those buttons... Like like yeah, I, I just said screw it after that. <laughs> Yeah, pressing those buttons will open those doors, but they're timed. Yeah. Like so. having the having the wing or the jet ability will make it easier to go through, but obviously there's, there's no jet around here right now, so. Yeah, I, I don't even think jet would make things easier. If anything, it would make it harder. Because because you need you need to you need to be able to maneuver in the air quickly, not so much on the ground. Well, the jet a lot gives you a speed boost. Well, yeah, but you'd still have to wait to charge and then like zoom your way through, which is really hard to do in an area like that. Yeah. But regardless, Russell, yeah, I know. I go it. back. I go back. You scrub, <laughs> Russell. <laughs> that, and now that was a mistake. God damn that it! That was a mistake. Calm down. You don't need the. You don't need to hold up. You just need to press A. Well, there was nothing here anyway. <laughs> so we just make our way back through the door. Through the door, Kirby. Kirby, thank you. Now be careful here because when you step on those blocks, they disappear, and they like to trick you with that when trying to get this treasure. So having wing here would be very good. Right. I'm, well, well, no, well no, I mean, well, that, you, you like... could puff, you could puff your way over the blocks, but you just don't realize well, that. that is, so. Yeah, it's not just that. You see, the blocks are what catch the, are what catch the treasure. Yeah. So you want to grab it quickly before it falls in the lava. Well, no, not, not just that. Like if, if you, um, if the block isn't there. When you when you drop the treasure chest, the, the lava will just. Well, I know, but I'm just saying, regardless, like if, I'm, even if you. I'm telling Danny because she didn't. Know. In the audience, because maybe they don't know. Oh, okay. We know you know, Russell. You played the game. <laughs> okay. We're not concerned about okay. you. Okay. I, I hope okay. you would know because you're playing the game. <laughs> oh no, man. Why is Waddle do? Uh... Spontaneously he's, combusting. He ran, he's dead. He, like, he ran out when, of when, when a partner runs out of health, they um, th th there's like I think it's like a 20 second time frame where I don't even think it's 20 seconds. I think it's like 10 maybe. 
regardless of size. There's a time period where they're in the middle of exploding, and you can save them by uh, by ch ch chucking a new item at them. But that really doesn't do much because even if they blow up, you could even if they blow up, you could just give up your your power to make a new one anyway. So yeah. there's really no points as far as I'm like. Is there a way to save the partner aside from giving them a new power? I don't think so. I think the second their health drops, they're done. Unless you toss another item. At them. Yeah, which really essentially is pointless because like even if they pop, you, just, you, you can create a new one anyway. So also it's kind of useless. Yeah. Also, is that is that is that the screw tech? Yeah. Yes, it was. Yeah. Uh, I, I forgot to mention like some of the treasures you find in this game are actually references to other games. Oh, you saw that we lost the ball. Kirby's not utilizing it. <laughs> you think Kirby would utilize it? As if he needs to. Yeah, Kirk, Kirby's got a magic wand. He's fine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Also, another thing about the Great Great Cave Offensive, this game, this mode warrants a lot of exploring. So you guys are gonna see me going back and forth a lot. Well, I, I mentioned earlier that how it's in Metroid Mania. Yeah. Metroid Mania is a typically Metroid Explorer. Oh, Metroid Mania. I mean. Mania Mania. It's just, it can be used. It can be. It can mean the same thing. Oh, depending on who you're. I don't know. Depends on, I'm depends on who sure, you're telling. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Vania is a completely different thing. Well, uh, again, depends on who you're telling. Zebra mask. Zebra mask. I don't know if that's a reference to Mario 2 or not. It no. might. I don't know. It looks like it. Uh, I forget the name of that creature. I, I know what you're talking Phantos, about. Right? Or, ph Phantos, yeah. Yeah, that, that. Yeah, when you get the key. And there we go. <laughs> and you, and, and you <laughs> lost your hammer. Good job. Oh. I don't need hammer. It, 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 it's a really good power, but I don't need it here. You got magic wand. You're good. Hmm. It's, it's not the beam's not the best power, but I really like what they did with beam in this game. Like I think, um, well, really, I think Kirby Superstar as a whole is one of the first games, if not the first game, to add a lot more versatility with their powers. A star stone. What does that involve? <laughs> what? Did you just make a Pokemon joke? Yes. <laughs> Wait, that'll take a second to click. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Down the ladder, thank you kindly. Plasma. Yeah, make sure you go to the very bottom of this area because, damn it, there's a uh, treasure chest here. Just watch out for borders. Yeah. <laughs> Beast Fang. Your little bird friend is about to die. Hank, Hank McCoy would like a word with you. Hey, what? Hank McCoy, I'm like a word. Oh, that name sounds so familiar. What joke are you making? Um, the Beast from X Men. Oh, okay, there you go. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> I shouldn't have to be explaining these jokes. Well, you're like the only comic book fan, like hardcore comic I, book I fan. Not all comic us. books. I just, I just like the lore. <laughs> but I still, the you, and the TV shows. But still, you know way more about that shit than we do. Yeah. Also, if you hit the X button, you can check to see what treasures you have. You see, you missed two. Scrub. I go back for them later. Calm down. Because you're, uh -oh. you're about to see something that everyone in the comments is about to laugh at me for. Uh, wow. Okay. Thanks, Kirby. Wait a, wait a miss. Yeah, fuck that. Okay, now you have a ninja? That's Tack. He has the copy ability, but as the par as a partner, he's actually probably one of the better partners. And here it is. Oh, Russell. I, now, this is why I but thought... To me, but to be fair, how the hell would you have known wow, that? Wow, wait a second. What was the check for? <laughs> so here's where I missed the first treasure. See, I've, I've never died in this, so I didn't know it sent you back that far. The fucking beginning. It actually doesn't. I screwed up somewhere along the way. And you found Meowth's gold coin. Hmm. I'm back, but yeah, I'm back I mean, here like, again. But yeah, I mean, it's like, how would you know that that would have been a bo bottomless pit? Yeah, that's just, like, that, that's just it. I didn't know. I thought there was something down there, so I went to check and I ended up dying for it. In which case, the the best way to actually do to actually do this puzzle wrestling with the wing ability, if you're using that, is to just shoot the feathers. Like like one 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 quick one to the left, one quick one to the right, and then fly. Hmm. Well, regardless, we got everything we needed. Oh god. You have Mr. Wisp there. Yeah, see, now we're caught up. So how many treasures are in this? Too damn much. 
<laughs> I forget the exact total, and I also forget whether if whether or not Ultra actually increases the, if increases the amount of treasures there are, or if there's just different ones. Because <laughs> I know there's definitely some tre some treasures in Ultra that aren't in this game, but I forget if it's whether or not they just replaced certain treasures from this game, or if they added more. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. Oh, okay. I'm not sure either. It's been a while since I played Ultra myself. You can do some post-editing magic to answer that question if you want. Oh, well, yeah, I guess. Oh. And, oh no, Tech! Tech! Wait, no, not... Well, yeah, actually, yeah, Tech. tech. Springtime? Yep, springtime. So you, pi you, you pick up a heart and they call that springtime. Yep. Well, I mean, in the spring, it's like it's when, it's when all the animals like to make that, like to do their loving. Okay, chill. I'm not wrong. <laughs> anyway. Uh, like, isn't, pretty sure it's mating season, isn't it? Is it? Yeah. Or anyway, regardless. So here we here we go to our first boss. So we got the Link Hat, and we have a Final Fantasy Black Mage. <laughs> and a whale. Yep. Ow. I think this guy's name is Statty Whale, actually. Yeah, so. He's smoking a pipe! <laughs> Ow. He is all of two and... He's all of three sprites. All of th oh, yeah, that's, oh yeah, that's true. Like He has two sprites to, for, for his tail to whack up and down, and he has one front sprite. Yeah, that's... Yeah, you're right. And then Ultra, they added one more sprite for him. A dying animation. <laughs> Smoke him if you got him! Up, oh, see, now you're Stone Kirby. Now you've officially won the game. H have I? Yes, because you know the best power. It, nah, it's not. It's really not the best power. It really isn't. It best really power. isn't. Really Trolley is. time! Don't uh, you, you, you forgot your helper. No, I didn't. <laughs> he just didn't want to ride in the trolley. See, he keeps running away. <laughs> he keeps coming back to you. There we go. Alright, next area. Filled with crystals. I do believe you need rock in this area at the very least. Mm, you don't need it, but... A dime. <laughs> <laughs> ten worth... cents. It's actually worth ten cents. No, it's worth ten gold. That's some shit. <laughs> Glass slippers. That's where they went. Cinderella would have got a word with you. <laughs> anyway. Kirby's just jacking everyone's shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just making sure I'm caught up with everything. Uh, okay. Let's go ahead and save real quick. And while we're at it. Alrighty, back to adventure. Adventure ho! <laughs> Alright, so this area is divided into three sections, so we want to go through each one if we want to get all the treasures. Yeah, um, I guess something else I forgot to mention, um... I'm not. Gonna, I'm obviously not going to be mulling around waiting to get certain treasures. So if there's certain stuff that I can't get, I'm not going to waste time going for it. The ones that I remember, I'll definitely go for. But aside from that, I'm obviously not trying to go for every single treasure in the game. Oh, actually, you know what? Speaking of Stone Kirby's, I wish there's, there's, there's something I, I do want to show you after this, at least. What? Um, and, and this will give the, the viewers a, 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 f a fun time of a fun time frame when we recorded this. Alpha Red. The guy who does the How to Do 101 videos, he just uploaded How to Do Kirby today. Really? Yeah. And oh! He, yeah, there, and there went that chest. Well! And, and yeah, that, that, that does... <laughs> oh, that was crash. Oh, let, let, me, let me just trash that real quick, because... But yeah, um... And, and this, what the, where did you last So one? I can get the treasure again. You can just leave <laughs> the room and go back in. Oh my gosh, what's that? Anyway... <laughs> well, this way he has more dignity. <laughs> All that for a for saucepan. A saucepan. <laughs> now Kirby can go. Anyway, anyway, like, I'm trying to get like I'm trying to get across here. Uh, one of the things that Alpha Red actually mains Kirby, and one of the things that he did in the video actually caught me by surprise. I didn't know you could do with Kirby and Smash. Really? Apparently, if you're right next to somebody and then and then use uh, the down B the down B stone attack on the ground, it does count as a strong hit towards a shield. Oh, really? Yeah, like, cause like, like, that was one of the moves he did. Like, he was, um, 
Like, like he, he came down on the opponent with, you know, the, the down A, you know, the, the spinning kick, Kirby spinning kick, in, in, the, in the air. And then as soon as he hit the ground, he went, he, 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 he stoned. Like, he was, he, was, he was already on the ground, and he just turned into a rock on the ground. But that counted as a strong hit towards towards the fox he was fighting, and that broke his and that broke his shield. Wow! Yeah, I do gotta I do gotta check that out after this. Uh, I want the treasure because yeah, I know you're you're a Kirby main yes. too. Yes. So yeah, I, I figured. Yeah, at the very least, like check out the video after. Oh yeah, I'll definitely do that. Yo yo. Much they like yo yo. Jet. No, don't. <laughs> they kill all him. die. <laughs> I mean, I, I had I had the trash crash anyway, so. So his cutters were a little bit more helpful for this area. At least in my opinion it is. So how do you get that treasure from the very bottom you, that you need you, you need to go to the very end of this pathway and it'll bring you to the beginning of the current where it'll drag you along that bottom path where you have to be quick and make sure you get the treasure chest and don't miss it, otherwise you'll have to go through the entire thing over Yeah, we're basically we're, uh, yeah, we're, we're pretty much making it making a lap around this area to get to, to get to that treasure. And that guy just dropped soggy bread. <laughs> it's like you break that because I thought you could go down there, but apparently you can't, so. Also, the item you just got, Mario's Bucket. I forget what, what game that was It from. was from a Jet. It was. I, I know what you're talking about. It was from a Japanese only game involving Mario. It's something about if once Wario put that bucket on Mario's head, he was brainwashed or something like that. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 oh, oh, I get yeah. it. I get it. Because if you put a bucket on somebody's head, the bucket is therefore upside down. And if there's an M on a bucket, then if you flip the bucket upside down, it's a yeah. W. <laughs> yeah. Clever. But yeah, it, it was a description that they... Uh, Poppy, no! <laughs> I believe it was in Melee that they um, talked about this, or at least had a trophy about that bucket in its description, and it was saying, oh yeah, that's that's what the purpose of that bucket was. So yeah, they actually made a reference to... Uh, Japanese only title. Just, just, just do the just do the, the slide kick. Summertime. 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 It's a green heart. You know what? Retaining to my earlier question about whether or not items in Ultra were either replaced or just added all together, I I think that may answer my question because I do I do not remember the, some of these items though. The springtime or the summertime, I I may just be I may just have bad memory, but I do not recall those being in Ultra. Those are nice items though. At least in my opinion, they are. Yeah, in which case, that, that, that was the spot we were talking about, Danny. <laughs> a one hundred dollar coin. Do those exist? Worth like a mil worth like a million bucks. <laughs> uh, do hundred dollar coins actually exist? I no, I don't. <laughs> okay. Anyway, moving on. Last area. No, as far as, far as, uh, as far as American currency goes when it comes to coins, I think, like, the silver dollar is the highest we have. Uh, then it just Then it just goes right to paper money. Right. Alright. Yeah, make sure you break, uh, not break, break every single block in here, because free treasure. Falcon's helmet? <laughs> Put it on, then he can do the falcon punch. Well, didn't he lose his helmet when he, like, falcon punched that guy at the end of the anime? And died. Yeah, oh yes. But then, but then, but that, that, but that was, but that was after this. Like, like many, many years after this. <laughs> I was about to say, so this is where Falcon's helmet went after that. <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's like, <laughs> no, yeah, this, this Kirby, Kirby this kept so it as a before. memento. Oh, you, you, you just found Maya's charm. Oh, Maya, okay. I was about to say, who? That was Maya's charm. I was about to say, who? I was like, oh, Phoenix Wright, okay. Well, red, though. Like, Maya's, Maya's red. Yeah. <laughs> well, that, well, well, that's just the Magatama stone. That's a pretty common stone in Japan. Oh, well, yeah. But when, I, but when I see it, I think of Maya. Maya. Yeah, I, I don't blame you. Oh, this, this part's just full of references, references today. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, th that is one thing I do like about the Great Cave Offensive, like the references that they make in terms of the treasures, but that's it. I do wish you could utilize more unique abilities from, from the partners, like with Mealy here with other with others. Yeah, but what can you do? A dud. A dud? dud? <laughs> oh, it's like a dud missile. Yeah. I don't, I don't remember that from Ultra at all, at all either, so... I don't know how a dud can be considered a treasure. <laughs> how can a saucepan, a saucepan be considered a treasure? Touche. <laughs> next day will be next day will be soap on a rope. Well, I mean, it's a treasure for Kirby because Kirby's best biggest treasure is food. Oh. Hmm. 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 Yeah, got you thinking there, didn't hmm. I? <laughs> so a dud missile. 
Uh, we don't want. We don't want to go in here just yet. Yeah, as you can see, we missed something. Well, yeah, like if you open the menu to the to, to, where, to where the treasures are, if there is a if there's gaps in between the treasures, then you miss. Yeah. Them. Well, like I said, as much as I'd like to, I'm not. Really? I'm not gonna go for every single treasure as much as I'd like to. The truth mirror. The truth mirror. I don't know. If, I don't know if that's a reference to something or not. Anyway. Hmm. It's like Harry, tra Harry Potter. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. God. I knew I'd think of one. God damn it. <laughs> uh, let's take Fighter Kirby. I, I almost went for Jet just because we didn't see that one yet, but it's like, eh, Jet's not going to be helpful for this boss fight, so. Well, I'm trying to think. This came out on Super Nintendo, didn't yes. it? Yes. Yeah. Uh, RPG oh. bosses. <laughs> okay, it's like, wait, why are we getting pop-ups? Because <laughs> we, we went from a beat-em-up game to an RPG. I, f I forget the name of this boss in general, but it, it's, a, it's an RPG boss. <laughs> okay. But yeah, there's just reason I was asking with the uh, the truth mirror. I wasn't sure, like, could that be considered a reference to uh, Link to the Past? Maybe. Maybe. Hmm. Yeah, because I mean, in Link to the Past, I mean, you did get a mirror. Granted, it was broken, but you did get a mirror that would help you. I think uh, I'm trying to recall. Didn't that like help you go from go into the dark world? I don't know if I don't know if truth was in its name, but yeah, there was a mirror that like took you uh, to and from the dark world. Right. I know later install uh, it later installments they have like the lens of truth, but I don't think it was called lens of truth in Link to the Past. I think lens of truth was Ocarina of Time, which right. had to have come after this. Yeah. So I was like, hmm. So it's like, yeah, not quite sure if that was a Zelda reference or not. For all I know, it probably wasn't. Well, here is the second the second best power after stone. What hammer? Yes, yeah, hammer's amazing. What? Well, oh, because of that attack, you're busy. Hammer is the best. Massive. Well, that's just because BJ's got a hard on for hammers. <laughs> but stones are better. Bullshit. Four greediness points. Four ambition points. Two honesty points. Two courage points. And three friendship points. <laughs> Does any of that matter? <laughs> nope. Nope. <laughs> So the game's just deliberately fucking with you. Yeah, it's, yeah it, it's, an R it's an RPG boss, so of course you gain experience from fighting RPG yeah, bosses. Yeah, it's them taking a stab at RPGs. Anyway, Charlie time. And then Kirby wouldn't get his own RPG until years later in Mass, in mass Attack, only through a, only through a sub-quest. Oh, yeah. hm. Mini-game. Woo! That was Kirby's first and last RPG. Right. But anyway, that's gonna be it for this part of Kirby Superstar. We'll see you guys next time as we move on deeper into the Great Cave Offensive. Until next time, guys. Until next time, guys.